various dangers which armed conflict involves for monuments, works of art, rare books, public and private records, scientific collections and every other class of article denoted by the term cultural property has attracted attention for many years past. In 1939, the International Museum's office published a handbook setting forth the measures that should be taken to reduce the possible effects of warlike operations on monuments, museums, the collections housed in them, and the shelters in which those collections might be temporarily stored. The measures described in that handbook were those suggested by the experience acquired during the First World War and other more recent conflicts. The Second World War, however, revealed the inadequacy of those measures owing to the greater destructive power of modern weapons. <laughs> 